Alright, so this is a quick tutorial on setting up a fragment server. Uh, before you do this, you're going to have to open port uh, 20,000 on your own. Any port forwarding guide can help you. So after you've successfully done that, you can continue watching this. So, download the area server file found in the video description. And extract it, open it up, and open the exe. Click run. We'll have this open up. Once it loads in, click Publish, Area, Authenticate Disk ID, you'll get this message. So now what we do is we open the emulator, we go down to Area Server, once it loads, Your connection should already be set up if you follow the other video tutorial. Connected to network. Now you're going to get this menu. So all you need to do is leave the port default. For the IP address, you're going to want to open a command prompt. Type in IP config. Go down, you'll find your IPv4 address right here. This is mine. Copy that. Enter it in here where it asked you to. Click OK. It'll say the connection has been set up. Disconnect return. So, somebody spelled connection wrong. Smooth. So, open up the area server. You'll see that it was successfully authenticated. So you can go ahead and close this. Go to the map editor. You're going to click file, new area. You can type whatever server name you want. Give it any sort of symbol. Pick your root town if you'd like. Click OK. File, save. Save it to the first slot, whatever you want. Close out of this. Publish. Publish area server. Select the one you just created. And you're done. You only have to do this the first time you set up your server. From now on, you can simply go into publish, click area, publish. Uh, that's it. If anybody has any connect issues connecting to your server, you can check your firewall settings to make sure the area server is enabled. And if you have any questions on setting up keywords or even maps, there will be another video explaining that.